Hey, peace. Then I'm talking quiet because I'm out here by the fire by myself. It's kind of late out here. You know, people sleeping and stuff. But let me tell y'all something, man. 2024 is the year of more. And um, you're going to you're gonna get your blessings, but you got to be prepared to receive them. And I'm telling you right now, you can go into this year with worry and regret, or you can go in this year with appreciation and gratitude. But you're going to get what you go into it with. Be grateful for what you have and where you are and build where you are. Is there something that's not going your way? Don't fret about it. Just figure out how to conquer that obstacle and get over it. 2024 is your year. Get it. Go do it. Those goals, those aspirations. Don't just walk through life and just kind of exist through it. You can't just go through it like that. That's existing. That's not really living. You have to be aware of what you, what you need to do and have the discipline to go do it. And that takes practice. It takes building habits. So what I would offer you to this is <clears throat> to set a goal. Whatever that goal is. Set a goal. Put it pen to paper. This ain't no New Year's resolution and none of that nonsense. I'm talking about setting goals. Write a goal down on a piece of paper. And then think about the steps you need to take. You have to really do some time. Get away from all distractions and think about the steps you need to take to accomplish that goal. And then write those things down under a little subtitle, action steps. And then what you'll find is, as you do those action steps, you get closer and closer to accomplishing that goal. And that could be with your family. That could be financially. That could be a fitness goal. But stick with it. And stay with it. Hold yourself accountable. That's what grown folks do. We hold ourselves accountable. That's the difference between adolescence and adulthood. It's accountability. Man, happy new year. And have a wonderful, wonderful 2024.